Hi, welcome to your channel, The Ancients. I'm your host, Dr. Moharam Ghosh, and I'm back today with another very informative video for all of you. The video I bring for you today is a Ganesh Chaturthi special, 10th September 2021 is Ganesh Chaturthi. And all of us will be doing prayers to Lord Ganesha. On the video today, I will be sharing with you some items which must never be offered to Lord Ganesha and mistakes to be avoided while doing prayers to Lord Ganesha. If you make these mistakes and offer these items to Lord Ganesha, you will face obstacles, poverty and misfortunes. Therefore, welcome only good luck, good fortune, prosperity and happiness and joy into your homes by avoiding these mistakes and not offering these items to Lord Ganesha. But before I go on to this, details. Let me share with you a brief about the channel The Ancients. I started this channel The Ancients in February 2021 and in a short span of about six months we have garnered over 283 subscribers and 4500 views. The reason for this phenomenal growth is I share with you the very essence of astrology, numerology and Vastu. I have spent over 23 years researching these ancient sciences of astrology, numerology and Vastu and to help ensure good health, prosperity, good fortune, peace of mind and harmonious relationships for you, I bring the very essence of astrology, numerology and Vastu. To you. Therefore, please do subscribe to the channel and also share these videos with your friends and family so that they too benefit and they too become our subscribers. Coming to our mistakes to be avoided and items never to be offered to Lord Ganesha. The first item is never do puja to Lord Ganesha wearing black or white dresses. Avoid black and white dresses completely. Instead wear the bright colors such as green, yellow, red, pink, orange, etc. Avoid black and white clothes at all costs. Number two, never offer white flowers to Lord Ganesha. Always offer yellow, or red flowers to Lord Ganesha. Number three, never do tikka with white sandwood to Lord Ganesh Ji. Always offer him sindoor as a tilak. Number four, tulsi leaves should never ever be offered to Lord Ganesha. If you offer tulsi leaves to Lord Ganesh Ji, your wrath and puja do not give you the benefits. In fact, they anger Lord Ganesh Ji very much. Therefore, avoid angering, angering Lord Ganesha and avoid bad luck, poverty and obstacles. Pray to him with the proper rituals and right items to ensure good health, prosperity, good fortune. Number 5. Wise tries should never be offered to Lord Ganesha. Always add haldi to rice so that the rice becomes yellow. Number 2. Talking about rice, you must wash the rice so that it becomes wet and then only offer it to Lord Ganesh Ji. Never offer dry rice to Lord Ganesh Ji. It must be wet. 
and never offer broken pieces of rice to Lord Ganesh Ji during the puja. Ensure that the right pieces are complete. Number six, Durba. Durba is much loved by Lord Ganesh Ji. He consumes Durba grass. I have seen people keeping Durba grass at Lord Ganesh Ji's feet. Never do that. Put it in a thali where you offer him bhog and prasad. If you keep Durba on his feet, he cannot consume it. Keep it in a plate and offer it in count of 21 pieces only. There is a legend when Lord Ganesh Ji was protecting the Devtas, he fought the Anasur Rakshasa and consumed him. After consuming the Rakshasa, Lord Ganesh Ji felt very uncomfortable and burning sensation in his stomach. So, Rishi Kashyap offered him 21 pieces of Durba, which he consumed and felt better immediately. So, Ganesh Ji is very fond of Durba, but you should ensure that you offer only 21 pieces. Number two, never place it on his feet. Number seven, avoid white color items in his prasad and puja. Never wear white dress, never offer white chandan and never offer white flowers. White is to be avoided totally during his pujas. Next, number eight. When you light a diya for Lord Ganesh Ji, put little bit of haldi in the ghee and ensure that you keep the diya not on the floor but on top of a yellow or red cloth, never a white cloth. Alternatively, you can keep it in a bowl of rice in which haldi has been mixed already. So you can keep the diya on top of the bowl of rice. Last item, the ninth item on the list of mistakes to be avoided and items never to be offered to Lord Ganesh Ji are dead flowers or torn flowers. Dried flowers. Avoid this at all costs. It brings poverty and obstacles in your life. Always offer Ganesh Ji fresh flowers in red and yellow colors and ensure they are not broken or dried. It must be fresh yellow or red flowers. Friends, 10 September 2021 is Ganesh Chaturthi. The most auspicious time for the puja is morning 11.30 to 1.30 pm. Do your puja to Ganesh Ji between this time. You will find the most auspicious benefits. Friends, I am sure you will benefit a lot from the multiple videos which I bring to you with the essence of astrology, numerology and vastu. My request to you once again is please subscribe to the channel and also share these videos with your friends and family and encourage them also to subscribe. Till we meet again with another informative video on your very own channel, The Ancients. Good luck, all the best and wishing you and your family a very happy Ganesh Chaturthi.